We're one minute late. This movie was so not worth it. Going, well, <laughs> I hope you're going to have a fun day. I hope I have a fun day. And I just thought I haven't shown you me doing yoga for a long time, and I know a lot of you guys liked it. And yes, I still do go yoga on a regular basis, like I think ugh, um, four or five times a week, something like that. The other two days, I just can't get myself to get out of bed really early which I do try on the other four to five days so uh, yeah it was so good and I always feel like I can move after yoga you know when you wake up and you're so stiff and, uh, and then you do yoga and you're like yeah baby so now I'm just gonna make some breakfast and Steph and I are going to watch one of my favorite TV shows at the moment well actually it's one of my favorite TV shows of all time please don't judge me I am a fan of really really um, well, low quality TV shows. <laughs> and I love Temptation Island. I would never enter, but I love to watch it. In case you don't know what Temptation Island is, I guess it's an international format, but just let me explain real quick. Um, they invite four couples over to an island and they put them in separate houses. So the men will be in the men resort and the women will be in the women resort and then they invite like 10 uh, seducers for the men of course 10 women for the women 10 men and then they well the thing is the seducers have a job and i think uh, actually i know quite sure they get paid if they seduce someone and then uh so yeah the game is on are you able to resist temptation of not cheating on your partner and i think it's <laughs> like so dumb like everybody has their temptations and in the right circumstances everybody will cheat seriously like but why put yourself in that position and risk your relationship it's just for me it's just dumb but it's really fun to watch on television am i the only one who loves cheesy television and just not even cheesy television just real bad television but i just like it i love geordie shore i love jersey shore i love uh, i love the dutch television show gouda kooi which means the golden cage <gasps> it was the best my my biggest addiction to date i had to watch it every single day and yeah that's my uh, guilty pleasure, man. I ordered something and I'm so happy about it because honestly, there is nothing better than this product. That works for me. But um, yeah, it's amazing. Dun, 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 dun. It is Lady Speed Stick. Ugh, I was already thinking that it would be, I think this is the normal packaging. But before this, I had like the jumbo packaging, which was awesome. So I have this one, which is five benefits in one. And then, what else do I have? What did I order? Invisible dry for <laughs> those of you guys who will uh, who want to recommend me baby powder. I cannot stand that smell. I hate it. And this is aloe protect. So. These are the... Oh, let me smell it. I'm sorry. I look like a crack junkie. That's how I look on a Saturday. I hope you don't mind. So, this is Aloe Protect. It smells a little bit like perfume. It's sweet. It's floral. But still fresh. I like it. It's a good, uh, good scent. Now, this one. Invisible Dry. I think I already had this one. Yes. Super fresh. Uh, reminds me of a detergent smell. Love it. Yes, I already had this one. Oh, love it. Love it, love it, love it. I don't know. I just used baby powder too much. And ooh, now it's like... Bleh. And this is... Oh, five in one. Also detergent scent. Super fresh. 
a little bit sweet love it i think the the aloe protect is my favorite let me smell it again it smells so good yes i think this one's my favorite but i really like the five in one as well i i like the the soft fresh scent mm, yes so now i don't have to stink anymore i ordered these at uh, what's it called i think it was exclusive scents something like that because we don't have Lady Speed Stick in the Netherlands in the supermarket, which is really unfortunate because it's the best deodorant ever. And uh, luckily, we can order it online. It's a lot more expensive, but I hope um, uh, to go to the US one day and get like ish loads of Lady Speed Stick. Like, that will be my biggest souvenir. Lots and lots of Lady Speed Stick. Yeah, breakfast is done. A baguette with some hummus, and this is baba ganoush. Doesn't look tasty. It is real tasty though. Temptation Island. Oh my gosh. And it promises. Like the preview showed it's gonna be... It's supposed to be a really good episode. So can't wait to watch it. Meanwhile, the laundry struggle is real. I haven't done any laundry in such a long time. And now I have to do everything. Yeah. Sometimes you just have to be honest to yourself. Oh wait, wait, please stop interrupting me. Yeah, sometimes you just have to be honest to yourself and my um, my um, greatest skills are definitely not in housekeeping. I have so much respect for those uh, women who manage to maintain everything neat and clean all the time. Uh, I'm definitely not one of those. Hashtag the struggle is real. Alrighty, I have made myself somehow decent and I want to film a uh, video for you guys for tomorrow, the road back to India episode two, because I need to clean out um, my stash of travel stuff. Let me just show you. It's in the drawer, in this drawer. Look at this mess, seriously. I need to clean this out because then I know what I need to restock um, and other things I need to buy. I need to throw out old stuff that I don't need anymore or that I just know that I won't use during travel. So yeah, just gonna do that right now. Maybe I should eat first. Yeah, gonna have food first. And dinner is ready. So we got here stir fried lentils with just onions and a little bit of mustard seeds, um, defrosted peas, little green peas, and um, tomato mash. Uh-oh. <laughs> I decided to spice up my blood sugar. Holy snap, this chocolate is... The more I eat, the more I realize this is perfection. I was just Googling where I can buy it. It costs six euros, but um, I'm not freaking joking. I'm willing to pay that because it's amazing. And this, this version also has uh, the cocoa nibs in it. The one that I showed you, which are so incredibly good. And the, the thing is, like, this is 70%, but it's so smooth. Seriously, like, usually this high percentage is, is a little bit bitter, but, ugh. like, I love my chocolate, man. Like, if you know me longer, if you know my tasting videos, you know, like, chocolate is my soulmate. I'm going to marry it. I'm going to have babies with it. Sorry, Stefan. But <laughs> this is... Mind-blowing. Yeah, I uh, I was googling where I can buy it and I'm I'm a girl on a mission. I need to have it. All right, setup is done. Let's film this baby and I'm filming this on my other camera and I think I'm gonna make the close-ups with this camera. Uh, yeah, so excited. I think this is the longest video I ever filmed. I knew it would take me this long because it was just a lot of stuff to go through. I hope it was useful for you guys and uh, yeah, I'm just uh, so tired we're going to the movie theater right now oh by the way if you're thinking why are you filming this so late you could have filmed it on any day before in this week you don't need to do it the day before it needs to be published well the thing is i wanted to make an episode about learning hindi because i definitely want to learn a little bit more hindi before i go back to india but i was just too afraid Seriously, I don't know why. It's just when you're a child learning learning languages, it's so much easier. You just repeat whatever you hear. But as an adult, you start thinking, you start overthinking. What if I say something wrong? Blah blah. While people 
seriously appreciate it so much if you just make an effort so i hope to <laughs> i hope i have enough courage for uh for practicing hindi in next week's episode and that's gonna be hilarious so now i cleaned everything up look the bed is empty again and let's go to the movie theater let's relax and we're at the movie theater again we're going to watch the revenant it shouldn't be sold out yet Stephen is already looking at me like don't say it on the blog because then it's going to be sold out but it's it should be okay the movie's been playing for a while so you should be able to get the tickets Whoop, not sold out all right salt popcorn medium i always somehow throw my popcorn on the ground even before i see it so I need to be careful about that. Wow, look at this ginormous popcorn. Like, look at my hand, look at the popcorn. It's huge. Usually I take the medium, and Stefan takes a sweet medium, but it's better for him now not to eat the sweet popcorn, so we just got a extra large. Look at it, it's ginormous, look at my hand. <laughs> the Revenant. All right, that was a dark movie. I didn't, really didn't expect that. Um, first hour even was quite boring for my taste but amazing spectacular acting by Leo DiCaprio and I really hope he gets his Oscar Steph and I have a problem now because right now at this moment it's 1.15 and the last metro is leaving <sighs> seriously this is freaking ridiculous we missed the last metro what the F we're one minute late this movie was so not worth it. Missing the last metro, what the F? <sighs> the metro starts again at 3.30. <sighs> There's probably another movie until that time, so yeah, let's just check it out, I guess. All right, so taxi it is. <laughs> this is ridiculous. We just paid two movie tickets for the taxi. Someone, up there is telling us, nope, you don't get free movie theater tickets. <laughs> it's ridiculous. By the way, what? I have my first fan account. This is so cute. Thank you. <laughs> I really like it. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed spending time with me. I enjoyed talking to you. Put a thumbs up if you like this vlog. Um, you can subscribe if you want to because then we can hang out more often. Thank you so much for watching. See you tomorrow. Love you. Bye. I made an Enterprise Me TV Pinterest board. This is the other actress, the cameraman.